I sent you some of uh, some of our student work, and I was wondering if you had any reactions you'd like to share with the with the students. Yeah, firstly, that curly piece. Were you all involved with that? Uh, the, 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 one class. The cyanotype. Yeah, one cyanotype. Right, one of the classes was. Uh, yeah, pretty, I, I, uh, I, yeah, I was blown away by that. I thought that was amazing. Firstly, I think that it really um, illustrates the idea of an embedded concept. This idea that you've taken something extinct, like the curlew, so we have a romantic attachment to that. You've taken this, this, this the physical entity of, of substrates, as, and then you've, you've used a medium which is so reliant on, on, it's so temporal, it's so reliant on time, it's so brief which is sunlight. And it's so um, romantic in that you can't capture sunlight. You can't hold it, you can't contain it. So this, this image of this thing that uh, doesn't exist anymore is from this entity, the sunlight, that we can't contain or quantify in a way or, 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 um, <clears throat> or, or define or, or recreate. So, um, so in that way, I think using the, the sunlight and the extinct um, or the redundant technology um, encapsulated and um, didn't just illustrate, but really embodied our, our attachments and our, our emotional need to reconcile this, um, this extinction and loss that's so profound for us. So no, I was really impressed with that. The videos, I was very impressed with those. <laughs> and I really recognized in the videos my own um, process. Because you're, you're listening and you think, is there anything coming? And then suddenly comes and you're in this strange, quiet environment on your own. There's something quite um, revealing, I think, to yourself about that. Um, which I think that process in itself to experience that process of listening to that slowed down bird song. That's quite a revealing thing to, to just to experience. And that's what a lot of the people who are involved in Dawn Chorus talked about. They talked about the shift they had to go through. They literally had to slow themselves down. They felt like they were in another world, uh, this, this sort of weird alien bird world, this medieval jazz. Um, is it music or is it noise? What is that? Maybe it's our first music. Anyway, yes. So great Thank work, so great work. Thank you. Very impressed. Thank you.